What is up, YouTube? It's Jacob here, and I'm uh welcome to NBA 2K16 My Career Mode Part Four. Uh, today we're doing our first freshman year Michigan vs. Greg Town Hoyer's College game. Okay. I think I'm a one gun boy. Uh, oh yeah, and I'm putting my friend in the description below. He really needs to grab it too. Welcome everyone to an exciting broadcast of college basketball here on 2K Sports. Some great action in store tonight, seeing some of the best and brightest young players on the hardwood. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. It's the Georgetown Hoyas and the Michigan Wolverines. And, and you know, guys, we go back many years broadcasting. Trice guy right now. And it never gets old. Every big time player Please. makes a name for themselves at the college level. Come on, Ringo. And we could see that again on display here tonight. Well, with a guy like the reason I, up, you know. the reason I pick uh, Michigan because that's my favorite team. Know that there are going to be scouts watching his every move, but you look at the roster of both of these teams, and they're really loaded with talent. A look at the Hoyas' starting group. We got Price. Hudson is out there with Warren, and it's Trice, and it's Randolph in at the two. You know, so often we can forget that these players are student athletes. I mean, Freak does not have that problem. He's an amazing student off the floor and is very dedicated in the classrooms. And how about Freak with a 4.0 GPA, an honor student in high school, and has carried that same work ethic to college as well as he prepares for his games. He truly embodies what it means to be a student athlete. Kicks it out to Jones. Outside Bosch. Over Trice, and he sinks that yeah. one in the back of the rim on the way in. And it's six points for Freak. Up by four. What a first half it's been thus far here for Freak. This is why so many think he'll be a star at the next level. And you can take all the measurements and do all the data analytics you want to, but all it takes is one half of watching Freak play when he's hot like this to know the star is in his future. There we go. Because it's almost impossible to think about Michigan basketball Keep and missing. not think of the Fat Five. I mean, one of the most storied recruiting classes ever. They were dominant in their tenure here at Michigan. And thinking back to the Fab Five, there were five freshmen all brought in the same year, and they all started. Yeah, yeah. Chris Webber, Howard, Jalen Rose were the most successful pros. All of them playing professionally at some level. It's still considered one of the greatest freshman classes, if not the greatest of all time. Harkless is checked in for Trice. Both free throws good from Bosch. There you go. And at the line, it's all about consistency with him. His routine, his stroke, it never wavers. They set the pick. Harkless with it. He feeds it to Warren. The Hoyas with another miss. And no excuse right here, right here. for missing that one after being it's freed up by here. a great pick. Yeah, I agree with you. I mean, they came away empty, but they got the look they wanted. And really, I I've enjoyed, I like the movement and communication there. There we go. Be the first of a lot of mid-range jumpers that we see from him. On defense, Michigan. Harkless kicks to Randall. The Hoyas with another miss. You know, even though he missed that three-point shot, I think the defense has to do a better job of challenging the shot. Yeah, as a coach, you can really yeah, go forward to have those types of opportunities presented against your defense. Harkless kicks to Price. Hoyas moving the ball around. That was a good screen. 
Nicholas with the bucket. <laughs> well, Merry Christmas. I mean, that was a freebie. So Michigan ends up going with the new group. And here are the Hoyas now, trailing by two, taking a look at the Hoyas. Hudson is up there with Warren, and it's Trice, then there's Price, and it's Randolph in at the shooting guard position. Now, here's Trice. 157 left in the first half of basketball. He is one guy you do not stand in the way of when he decides to attack the rim. Well, Georgetown has been such a pillar of East Coast basketball for so long. Really one of the universities on the East Coast. Yeah, you know, that's exactly right. A really <sighs> rich tradition in men's basketball for the Hoyas. And they've been a competitive presence on the college basketball landscape going back to the 70s. All right, we're up our one. And for the Hoyas, they really are one of the defining members of their If you guys don't like comics, the guy talking to me and I'll turn it off. Thinking about the Hoyas, the blue and gray they wear it is really just iconic. They set the pick to the left wing. Randolph, no one around him. And no good. Had a chance to take the lead. And Michigan has possession. And you know the Hoyas ah, have the college tournament title in their history. They won it all in 1984 and then returned in 85 to the title game only to be upset by Villanova. Georgetown trails by four. One thing with Freak that we know is he makes sure he gets his shots up no matter oh, what. Oh, damn, that was my guy. One way or another, he's going to get his workout in, and that's why so many are confident that he'll continue to improve. Part of it is that he has a twin sister who actually taught him how to play ball. <laughs> She helped him develop his game and become the player he is today. Pr pretty nice to have a sibling willing to help you develop your skill set on the court. Here's Trice. 36 seconds left here in the first half. He dishes it to Hudson. I mean, that's a tough break. Oh, he fouled him. Good job, good job. Fourth quarter. Third quarter again. All right, we're up by five. Ten points. All right, good. And we welcome you back to college basketball here on 2K Sports as we get ready to get going for the second half of play. Guys, you know, it's been a close one thus right far. Right here. Both teams have had strong stretches, but neither team has really been able to take control of the game to this point. Yeah. It's kind of like a, a, a boxing match, a, a bit of a feeling out period thus far. The second half, we should see more things open up, and that should benefit star players like Freak, who will get more quality opportunity. On the court for Michigan. But in a shooting guard, Ellis is out there with Smith. And there's Flash, and it's Jones in at the three slot. No good from Price. And, the, and they're controlling the boards, Kevin. That's plus five in that category. And, guys, you know that rebounding is a huge part, a huge component of winning games. It's not a glamour stat, but it's necessary if you're going to be a winning team. Boy, they are passing the ball very crisply right now. They really are, and their last three buckets have come by way of an assist. And you look at the long list of former players from the University of Michigan, a lot of big-name NBA players got their start as Wolverines. It's been that way for a long time. And plenty of contact on the shot, so two free throws coming up. Yeah, way to play in attack mode and get to the line. And, you know, the defense gets their money's worth on that foul, stopping the layup and not giving up the and one. Michigan making some changes. Cunningham, he's checked in for Ellis. Jefferson comes in for Jones. And Banks is subbed in for Flash. And then for Georgetown, Joseph comes in for Hudson. And it's Wilson in for Price. And you see a lot of players who are very tough. Ooh, a three. Play with a me first approach. That is not the case. The, the three for you, you two. Attract any unnecessary attention and just focuses on playing his game. Yeah, I like that about him, Greg. I mean, in a day and age where most guys are self-centered and it's all about me, it's refreshing for a player like Free who doesn't invite that kind of noise. I mean, that's 
that's as impressive as his skill set. That's good from Jefferson on the assist by Buck. Getting all those back and stuff. Always depend on him or what to lead you to the right place with that pass. Money. And here's Trice. Picked by Randall. Trice dishes the one. Oh, my bad. It down. And you know, that's an example of how many plays we have in the game for which there's no stat. A monster dunk coming off just a terrific pick play. Greg, you're right. It really did work to perfection. Gave him all the room he needed for the flush. Boy, that's a sound physical play. I mean, can't be afraid to put a shoulder into somebody every once in a while. It's a contact sport, folks. Trice gets to Warren. Oh, that's blocked. They get it back. Goes in the pass to Randall. Lays it up and banks it in. Randolph's got eight. You got to love the big bucket in the paint in this sort of grinded out physical game. That's the kind of look they can continue to go with. Maybe that'll help them create some separation How am I on the scoreboard. Now, Trice. There's the pick. Randolph can't get block. that one to fall. Not sure what, what the D was doing there. Clearly a breakdown. You can ill afford to give a guy yeah. like him that good a look. Taking a look at the Hoyas, they've got Warren, and it's Wilson in at the two. Got two minutes. Couple seconds left. There's 57 seconds Four left here. to play in the second half. And with Freak, he takes a lot of pride in where he hails from. Didn't go there we go. Here we go. Means, and his family cheers him on from Harlem. And Greg, you can see it in this game. I mean, we're all a product of where we've been, our environment, our experiences. And with Freak, he doesn't take anything for granted. Some of the very best players of all time. Oh. Have come from the so what we like know Freak, is that Freak, our character Harlem. from Harlem. He's on the court. Flash passes to Jones. Right here, right here. The three from Bosch. Can't get it to go. So Georgetown will take it the other way. This game's finally gotten away from them. Yeah, it certainly has. I mean, there's not really much they can do at this point. Here's Gonzalez, and he's good on the three ball. You guys ain't gonna win, so... Yeah, follow him. And that's an intentional foul. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Seventeen seconds left in the second half of basketball, and he commits the intentional foul. All right, we got free back at least. Good on the first, and that makes it a seven-point lead. And a tough break as his second attempt at the line. No good. Right side, Wilson. From beyond the arc. And it's Michigan with the rebound. Bosh, no one around him. Yeah. Gets it to go from the corner. Feeling it. No doubt about it. He's definitely okay. feeling it right now. Yeah. Need a terrific percentage from the All right, we won. And so it's Michigan winning this one. A confident win and one where they clearly showed the greater effort. They certainly put on a good show here. All right, there we go. See if there's a cut scene. If there's not, I'm probably going to end this video early. Alright guys, that's it for today. Thanks for watching my career mode part 4. And subscribe, comment, like. I need your feedback. My friend show in the description. Well, if you have four names, subscribe to him. I'll give you uh, some GTA later. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye.